Hi, it's your boy Pilla. We back. We was just reading uh, Drusilla Dungey Houston. Uh, 1926, talking about how the mound builders were the Kushites, which is African people. And so we just want to build on that. But I want you to look at this. This is one of our ancient schools. These are the statues of the people that built it. So when you talk about like colleges and all that, you can already see the structure, how we already had it set up, right? King, queen, sister, yeah, brother. Okay, so now we're going to read uh, George G.M. James' book, Stolen Legacy. Greek philosophy was the offspring of the Egyptian mystery system. So for those who say, what that mean? Stolen Legacy, uh, Greek philosophy was the offspring of the ancient African mystery system, page 178. And he says, The ruins of the ancient Grand Lodge of Luxor are found today on the banks of the Nile in, the, uh, in Upper Egypt in the ancient city of Thebes. It was the only Grand Lodge of the ancient world. It had branches or minor lodges throughout the ancient world in Europe, Asia, Africa, North America, South America, and probably Australia. These are some of the places, Palestine at Mount Carmel, Syria at Mount Hermon in Lib Lib Lebanon, Babylon, let that say Media, near the Red Sea, India, on the bank of the Ganges, Burma, Athens, Rome, Cretan, Rhodes, Delphi, Miletus, Cyprus, Corinthian, Corinth, like, like in the Bible, Corinthian, Crete, Central and South America, especially Peru, among the American Indians, Mayans, Aztecs, and Incas of Mexico. So let's read that last line. Central America, especially Peru, among the, among the American Indians, Mayans, Aztec, and Inca of Mexico. And this is called Stolen Legacy. Greek philosophy was the offspring of African mystery systems. Let's interpret that, right? And so when he says, the ruins of the ancient Grand Lodge are found today, you know, it's kind of blurry, Today, on the banks of the Nile in Upper Egypt, in the ancient city of the Deep, it was the only Grand Lodge of the ancient world. Now, look at this building. Look how big it is. This is 3000, 3000 BC, right? Type of stuff, right? He said it had branches. This is the ancient world. It had branches throughout the ancient world in Europe, Asia, North America. South America and probably Australia. Some people be like, Egypt, America is Egypt. Yeah, that's true. But, but Egypt is also in Europe, Asia, Africa, North America, South America, and probably Australia, right? And then he says, uh, now these are all lodges, which is nothing like, for like schools, right? You see the people who built these are the, the comedics, you know what I'm saying? Ethiopians. And then he says, um, he's talking about Delphi, India, right? The Ganges. Remember the guy said we rolled it from the world from the Ganges? And then he said, um, I'm sorry, it's kind of blurry. And he says, uh, Central and South America, especially Peru, among the American Indians, Mayas, Aztecs, and Incas of Mexico. This is George G.M. James. This is probably like mid-1900s. And so here you got a guy talking about, uh, it go a little better, can you see it now? talking about the African presence in uh, ancient America. As you can see now, I can kind of see it. He says, the rural ruins of the Grand Lodge of Luxor are found today on the banks of the Upper Nile and ancient city of Thebes. It was the only Grand Lodge of the ancient world. It had branches or minor lodges throughout the ancient world in Europe, Asia, Africa, North America, South America, probably Australia, there are some of the places, these are some of the places, Palestine at Mount Carmel, Syria at Mount Hermon in Lebanon, Babylon, Media near the Red Sea, India on the banks of the Ganges, Burma, Athens, Rome, Cretan, Rhodes, Delphi, Malaita, Cyprus, Corinth, Crete, Central and South America, especially Peru among the American Indians, 
Mayas, Incas, Aztecs of Mexico. George G.M. James, Stolen Legacy. Greek philosophy was the offspring of African mystery system, page 178. And so there go the people, the ancient Egyptian statues, Ethiopus. This is a, like a Grand Lodge. I just wanted to fact, one of my uh, guys from the gym just came from there but showing me pictures. And so we just read when uh, Drusilli Dungeon Houston was saying how the mound builders down in the, um, Mississippi were the Kushite race. Well, these are the Kushites. And you can see that even George Jim James in his book about Stolen Legacy, Greek philosophy was the offspring of the Egyptian mystery system, says that it had grand lodges throughout the ancient world. Oops. Throughout the ancient world, you can see. So yeah, also in ancient America. And so that's just your boy, as you can see, throughout the ancient world. And so that's just your boy pillar. So it's kind of blurry, but uh, you you get the point. And as you can see that, uh, yes, ancient, ancient America is Egypt. Ancient Africa is Egypt. Ancient Asia is Egypt. And Europe, right? We want in Australia. I'm gonna show you all that because because we really come back to Pan, Pangea. But uh, that's your boy Pella. We just building day by day, uh, hoping that uh, and also I'm, I'm gonna get a school going. We, we, we can really have longer videos because I know a lot of y'all always ask me about when the school open, and so I'm gonna get something cracking for y'all. Like right? it's your boy Pella. Love y'all. Have a great day. One.